mind though, some tricks for a rookie. Oh. What is keeping Leo up? He is getting tattooed here, and he has to go, and it's over. Got to like the power, got to like the accuracy, got to like the spite as well. A little bit of edge about him in there, when you, you need that. Yep, and the fact that he was never in any hurry. He knew, if I don't get him out this time, I'll get him out next time. With the left hand to the body. Oh, oh nailed him, oh, that right hand. <laughs> One more punch will get him out of there, and I think Howard Foster's getting ready to step in here because nobody wants to see Butlin get hurt. Body shot's coming in, he's all over the place here, and that's it, the towel comes in. Howard Foster says that's enough. Howard Foster, I mean, okay, you're dealing with a fighter's pride, he wants to put up a show, but uh, the, the night had caved in on him. You're not going to go overboard, as you say. You're not going to go out and win a world title tomorrow. We're not looking at another Lomachenko here or anything like that, but everything that you're asking him to do, everything you're hoping to see from him, you're seeing. Yeah, and then credit to Butlin. For no reason, yep. He's in no hurry. <laughs> Just lunges in. You've got to credit his bravery, but he's getting a pounding in there, and that's that. No, it's been stopped. The same was coming, but yeah, it was it was ruthless, so efficient. There's that knockdown once again. Three. To wind up the punches. So it was just this you know, turning out to be a real painful night for Kischek, which was only going to become more and more painful. So glad it didn't go on. He's just so heavy-handed, Joshua. He doesn't oh, have to oh, terrific right, right hand. hand. Again, Darts did well to take that. Darts is struggling. He's in trouble, and there is an argument that's to enough. say that's enough, and it is. The starch wasn't going to go easy. The right time to get him out of there, and it was pretty obvious. Now that was it. You could see him all over the place. I mean, it wasn't just that punch. And he's gone. One, two, and I don't think he wants any part of this. He's holding his ear as if the ear's gone, but now, no. He's moved it away, and he's not getting up. He had no interest. His head scrambled. This is not a little bit of damage there. Yeah, that was a good shot. Well, he was critical of himself last time, Anthony Joshua. Surely there's nothing not to like about that performance. In the high guard up there as Joshua died. Oh, oh, that right hand up a cut. Combination kind of got he got my leg to bend down the way he did right there with the overhand shot first and then set him up for the uppercut. Joshua looked to land the right hand, but he's taking his time and measuring it up, and that right hand did the damage. He just waited. See, that was a kind of glancing blow that seemed to come off the shoulder, and then the, the shorter right hand to follow up was a shorter jolting right hand. Inside two rounds for Joshua, takes his time, measures him up again, skulls all over the place. Steve Gray says that's it. A smile from the Watford man. Oh, oh that's, that's the one. Didn't miss that time. Took everything, didn't he? One big right hand. See, he was on the way to the floor. So, I mean, at this stage, it doesn't matter greatly. But uh, you have to really be careful of that. So down he goes and well... Well, to take that, they still be in there. Full credit to him. And it gets another one. The towel's come in, and he got absolutely slaughtered with a left hand. And as you say, no one's gonna, no one's gonna argue with this stoppage. I, Richard, done what he could do. Definitely a special talent in the heavyweight division. And well, back top was thinking about what he wanted to do, and that was a beautiful. Trying to tag him back. But again, just too sharp and too powerful from Joshua, who's slicing into ribbons here. And Ian John Lewis might have a job to do because Backtoff is so brave, he's standing up to this, but he is getting pounded, and Ian John Lewis did absolutely the right thing. Well, I thought he was stopping it. He should have been well, and he has. Past his best now, right now comes through, and he's wobbled, he's shaken by that, and Joshua straight on him and sprouts in big trouble here. Joshua just teeing off, Is that and Tyrell Connor says that will do it right there. For Michael Sprott to take, bang, that's the one, that's the job finished. Job's finished. The left hand this time. Didn't miss that time. One, two. And down he goes One, again, left hand again. Two, He's going to give it a go again. Eight, 
but this is this is getting ugly here and it's waved off it's done well, we saw that in his last fight i think jim that, that and you know he was asked about it afterwards and he more or less just swatted it away with with a shrug of the fighter he once was and a right hand Nothing wrong with keeping him busy, though. No, definitely not. I mean, you know, you've got to... Joshua going to work. Once again, and nails him! Now he's got rid of it, but can Johnson survive? Joshua looking up, just blitz him out of there. Inside a round, there goes the bell, and Johnson is finished. Punches he's taken there. Well, that reputation for durability is well, well deserved. But how much longer can this go on? And it's stopped. It's over. Done. Inside two rounds. Kingpin just got bowled over. Anthony Joshua right now. Yep, I agree with that, Nick. Yep, I mean, we don't want to see him overstretched. But uh, we certainly do want to see him in a, a match that is least competitive. The body there, Joshua, with a straight right hand. Ah. Joshua looking very sharp. Very nails him with a right hand. A little bit, he felt that one. And then bang, overcame the right hand. Joshua looking to measure him up. Could this be gone in the first? He's caught him with another right hand. And Cornish is in desperate trouble already. The right hand. It was knocking him onto his heels. I mean, look at the power and, and the jab there. Trying just to, to survive the crisis. But down the end, that was from the accumulation of the punches. When he got back up, his legs were unsteady. And there was no point allowing it to continue. The, the writing was on the wall by that time. It really was. AJ Anthony Joshua! Mauro Betty presents the WBC title belt. And Mick Collier from the Boxing Board of Control presents the Commonwealth. Ladies and gentlemen, we present your champion.